Yeah, so I, I just uh, did a tribute to my friend's mom, uh, Bert, Roberta Elliott, um, E-L-L-I-O-T-T. And it took me out into some fun times uh, when I was in the clinic. When I did my uh, internship, it was in the ghettos of Chicago. I did whatever it took to get there because uh, the clinician there was a big black man, Allison Henson, and I had heard that he was fairly open in how he handled the clinicians. And at one point he said, I don't care if you climb up on the table on top of your patient, squat on them, shit on their chest. If you call it therapeutic and they get better, I'll sign the forms. So it was pretty wide open. Uh, but uh, Elliot was on the other shift behind me. Um, I was on morning shift. I had to work so I could, I had to do the morning shift so I could work at night. And uh, we were in, the, literally in the ghettos in Chicago. Uh, the first day of clinic, apparently, I, I missed it, but uh, one man was running down the street street, uh, aiming and shooting a pistol at another man, <laughs> screaming. Uh, and it was so, it was exciting. It was exciting being there. But what we grew up with was a bunch of sitcoms, and sitcoms that I really found funny. I don't find many of them funny today, but maybe I'm old and cynical, but I don't find the humor imaginative. But that's a whole other story I'm not going to get into. But there was a one uh, called F Troop, and it was as stupid as can be. And there was a burglar, and the burglar was from Banff, okay? That's a place in Canada, and the place in Canada is B-A-N-F-F. -F. So the burglar was always called the burglar from Banff, and they always pronounced both of the F's, obviously. Uh, Dr. Elliot, Dr. Randy Elliot, was, who was on the, had been my roommate for a long time, his name was Ellie. E L L I O T T. So I oft times called him Dr. Elliot, and I found it tremendously amusing. Uh, when he arrived at the clinic, I told the black girls, that, and it was not really, the, the girls that worked behind the uh, uh, front desk were mostly black, and I said, Look, this new doctor, he's uh, pretty particular about a bunch of things, and one is his last name. And they said, what do you mean? I said, well, look at how it's spelled. And I said, yeah, Elliot. And I said, no. I said, actually, it's Elliot. And uh, <laughs> if you don't pronounce both the T's, uh, he gets quite upset. So, and they said, no, 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 you can't. I said, no, I'm not kidding. No, I'm not kidding. And so then when there was a new patient or a patient of his to the front, <laughs> several of the girls, <laughs> you would hear them with the microphone going, Dr. Elliot t t to the front. But on this, so well, I'm going to do another, that's a three-minute video, so that was my really funny Dr. Elliot T. Uh, Burgle from Banff, uh, because uh, tribute to Bert Elliot. Uh, but I'm going to go to another story about my clinic days, which uh, will be irrelevant to some, but enlightening to uh, who was around at that time. Thanks, www.micpeakperformance.com.